just when I thought I was getting ready to shut it down for the night, uh, I had to put this one out. I saw the Gear Tactics trailer. Now, I don't play Gears of War uh, normally. I have a PlayStation 4. Uh, Gears Tactics is for Xbox, but that looked pretty cool. I also like the fact that they promoted no microtransactions, and with it being a tactics game, it plays different. So you're setting up the tactics like here, 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 here with the military. So I thought that was really cool. And um, I like the way to look to Marcus Phoenix, uh, young and stuff with the little hair and the thing. And it actually looked really awesome. And it looked like a fun game. And they had five classes. Like I saw they had the scout and uh, they had a sniper and all that stuff. And uh, it looks like you can recruit people. You can make them and kind of gear them up and everything and train them into gears and everything. And it shows the monsters and how the war started. And I played it like it didn't work. It was very funny. It was entertaining. I hope they do a Gears movie. I would love to watch that movie. Um, but I just wanted to do a quick trailer reaction. It's pretty cool. You should go check out the trailer. Uh, it looked action-packed. It looks awesome. For anyone who likes tactic games, it looked like a really good one. I see that they had a lot of cutscenes and did it. And they kind of explained Ukon, uh, which... I do. I like. I know a little bit about gears. It's. I'm not gonna say I don't uh, use it on real world and stuff. Yeah, but uh, I still follow the story. But yeah, I think it was a cool video game trailer. I think it was awesome. Uh, it looks like with the tactics, you and you can like kind of power people up with the five things. It looks like one was like a heavy, uh, where they had the big gun. So, but you gotta like do it just right because you don't want to have too many and too not. And I like games like that from time to time because it makes you think a little different. Because like I'm a guy who sometimes will lean on the heavy. Um, even when I'm playing group games, I'll, I'll play the big guy or something. But sometimes it works to play the far one or play the one that puts the bombs down. So it looked really cool. It looks like you're gonna get a lot of backstory about how that world got set up the way it was and the way it is. Uh, definitely look like you got a lot of backstory. So that was pretty cool. Uh, definitely, if you are an Xbox person, you're especially if you're a fan of Gears, I think this is a good one for you, uh, for what I could tell. But I love the fact that they were like, know this, no microtransactions, because, you know, that's like a gamer's nightmare now. Uh, I play Marvel Future Fight, and they're always like, oh, play this and play that. And I'm like, no, I'm not paying $70 for like a couple thousand crystals. That's, that's ridiculous. I'm not paying... Sixty dollars and then another sixty and another thing to get mystique. Like it, it's crazy how sometimes these games do it. So that's it. Just to bring that noise review real quick. Um, I'm being low key because really I was about to go to bed and then I happened to see it right before I took it down. So this is the geek protagonist. See ya. Be safe. Stay clean. Keep yourself up. We'll get through it. <laughs>